What up guys, I have some good news for you guys. Got my shipment notification from Apple. Um, basically my iPad is on its way. It says the delivery date is going to be March 16th, which is great. Um, I got it yesterday. Today is the 10th at 2.44 in the morning, but I got it on the 9th around 6 p.m. I think. And basically the email says, if you want to take a look at it, Dear Mike, that's me. And we're happy to let you know that the items below are on their way to you. We also included delivery estimates and tracking information next to your shipping address. Thank you for your time and for shopping with Apple, the Apple Store. So this is good news. Um, we know now that my iPad 3, new iPad, whatever you want to call it, is on its way. Here's the most interesting thing. When I check the, um, the, the shipping update, which is... Uh, through FedEx, it says it's three pounds, which sounds about right, 1.4 kilograms. Um, it's going to be standard overnight, and it's actually located about 20 miles away from me, only 20 miles. So we know currently that the iPad is in circulation. It's being held at the shipping facility. This is normal for what Apple does. Um, it's being held at FedEx, and then once the date comes, they're going to run it out there and throw it out and give it to all their uh, their customers. Um, my iPad uh, needs requires a signature. Basically, if you take a look at the screen, you can have an option of uh, pre-signing. You are waiving your pre-signature rights. Uh, if you pre-sign for delivery, basically what it means is if they knock on the door and you're not there, they can literally leave it on your doorstep. If they leave it on your doorstep and someone walks by and grabs it, no one's liable now. I mean, no one's going to take the blame for that because you already, do the, you already did the pre-sign for delivery. For me personally, I'm going to keep the uh, re re signature required so that way I can answer the door, someone else answers the door, or they can drop it off at uh, an office or something for me. But I, I want a signature, so that's basically what it is. So for all of you guys thinking about doing a pre-sign for delivery because you're afraid that you might miss the uh, the delivery guy, don't do it because if he leaves at the door, someone walks by and boom, your iPad is gone. Um, that's the last thing you want to happen to your uh, five, six, seven, eight hundred dollar iPad. But that's pretty much it. My um, iPad, I, I got a 16 gig, just basic, and uh, it's going to be white, and it's the third, third generation one. Um, it's pretty much the same with an A5X core. Uh, it seems pretty great, but like I said in my other video, I'm going to go ahead and probably do a giveaway for you guys. I don't need one. I already have one, so I have plenty, um, so that it's not going to be a big deal. So I'm going to go ahead and do a giveaway. So make sure you subscribe to my video. Make sure you like this one. Uh, subscribe button's up there. Uh, whatever you need to do, just keep in touch. So that way you know when I'm going to make a video for you guys and send the iPad off. Um, if you guys have any questions, please leave a comment below. Make sure you message me or whatever you need to, and I'll try to answer what you can. Continue watching my other videos, and thank you very much for those who are still watching and still supporting me, and I do appreciate it. I know who you guys are. I know that you guys are the ones that you guys watch all the time because um, I get the most comments from you guys, and I know you, who you guys are. That does kind of help. So, Also, um, there is another video about the Siri proxy. If you guys are still interested in the Siri proxy that I was testing on my iPad, uh, send me a comment below this video or maybe my other video. Just let me know that you guys still want it. Um, if you guys do, then I'll go ahead and send it out. That proxy in uh, particular was kind of iffy. It wasn't working all the time because I wanted to give it a couple weeks before I gave it to you guys. Um, that proxy is okay. It shuts off every once in a while, so I don't know. But I do have a proxy that's running on my iPhone 4. Um, if you have any questions, remember, leave a comment below. Subscribe. Thanks for watching. Peace.